Those buildings didn't have windows on them because like literally it was part of a big cathedral, cathodes, those buildings had something to do with just energy in general. Right. Let's say that the atmosphere, there was a time when it was overly amplified with an electrical charge, okay? Which also would have its own residual dominoes that it knocks over and things that affect people's lives. Um, but let's say it did, then it stands to reason for me that whatever lightning strikes did happen would be on a massive scale to the point where, you know, cities would be, could be in danger from electricity from above. Um, or even jumping off from the ground as well. Um, if that were the case, then all of a sudden steeples make sense to me. And Gothic architecture with points and spikes and whatnot makes sense and like, to me. And like literally like those rigid looking, you know, like antenna looking things. You got all kind it, the spiked antennas. Yeah. Like, spiked antennas, uh, obelisks even. You could probably, yeah. you know, mm -hmm. throw those in there. Um, and, and that they're putting these on top of their tall buildings and stuff. And then they're, um, and then on the opposite spectrum, we have domes, metallic domes made of conductive material. Yeah. Um, I've done studies on this and, um, electricity in the form of lightning and whatnot is attracted to those domes. Um, it's, it's, it, it draws the electricity to it. Whereas the pointy structures, um, they actually help to dissipate the, the negative charge above in the air because pro, uh, protons actually rise up through and they shoot a stream of positively charged energy up into the air directly above, which dissipates the negative charge, which actually helps to reduce lightning. Um, they would Interesting. they would put a ground on it just in case it was hit because that negative charge can overcome it, whatever positive charge and it can be hit. But it re, it's those pointy structures and spires and steeples and whatnot help to keep lightning from hitting them. Interesting. Um.